Secrets of the Internet. It's your girl Darcy Pearl and um, I it's been a minute. It's been a minute. So I just kind of wanted to apologize to you guys. I know I said I would be doing videos every Friday. Things just, you know, got crazy. You know, I went on vacation. I'm getting ready to move. I've been working a lot. I've been preparing for Pagan Pride. I'm going to be a vendor there this year. And so I've just been crazy busy and I probably obviously will not be doing um, videos every Friday so I do apologize about that uh, but I have a special treat for you guys today I hope you guys enjoy this video it's going to be pretty cool um, I decided that I'm gonna go to the Freakling Brothers haunted houses now the, there's one haunted house that is said to be the scariest haunted house in the US so I'm super excited because this is my first haunted house experience and the fact that I'll be doing the scariest one in the US is kind of fucking freaky, right? I'm super excited to tell you guys about it. I've heard anyone that I've seen do a review on it or that has talked about it <laughs> said don't do it. Uh, so the rated R one, they, they do touch you, they push you, prod you, poke you, harass the fuck out of you apparently. Apparently you get water on you. They say that they're allowed to spit on you. I don't know how true that is. I mean, I really don't want to get fucking spit on, but I feel like I will do it for the experience. So these Freakling Brothers Haunted Houses, so it's called the Gates of Hell. And the Gates of Hell it is apparently haunted. And the ghost adventure, Zach Baggins, um, did a show on it actually and it is really creepy I watched the show and I got super pumped up and freaked out obviously <laughs> so uh, they have like um, symbols and all kinds of shit on the walls that apparently is of the devil or um, there's some witchcraft symbols in there that I don't find offensive but <laughs> there's some stuff uh, some like Satan symbolism. I don't fucking know. Anyways, apparently it's actually haunted. So I am really stoked to go and I hope, um, you know, I can't record on the inside, but I am going to bring you guys along with me for the ride. I'm going to meet my crew and I'm going to tell you how it goes. So, um, I'll see you in a little bit. Okay. So we have arrived at the gates of hell. Let's see if you can see it. We're kind of still in the parking lot, kind of pre-gaming. Trilogy of Terror, guys. Okay, let's go meet the girls. We're all here. We got Ursula. Are you going in? Probably. Okay. <laughs> and then we got V and Ashley. She's got to braid her hair because people are going to pull it and rip it the fuck right out. <laughs> okay, and then we got Kathy over here. I think that's our whole little gang that's going in. So Kathy's for sure going in. Hi. <laughs> so we can't apparently bring cameras in with us or our phones, which is kind of a bummer because I wanted to get up closer. So um, I guess we're just going to have to go in and then come back out and tell you guys how it went because yeah we can't but we did get here early so hopefully we beat the lines like the parking lot's not full yet so I'm super stoked about that I'm super fucking happy about that but we're gonna have a little liquid courage out here maybe eat some motherfucking tacos I'm actually like not nervous me either surprisingly that's what I'm saying surprisingly. you know what I think it's maybe because I had wine I don't feel that way but... <laughs> it's because I don't hear anything I don't hear yeah we don't hear anything yeah, yet yeah. there's no screaming because we're the first ones here yeah it's not even we would hear screaming though if we got here later, yeah. but there would also be massive lines. So um, we'll get back to you after we go through and we'll kind of tell you guys about it. I'm super excited. Again, this is supposedly the scariest house, uh, haunted house in the US. And um, so yeah, let's, fuck, let's see how it goes. <laughs> They were really I, fucking screaming, guys. I might be doing Dude. vampires. <laughs> no! She's what? like, that's it. No, okay, so I'm listen. I'm doing all three. What? We're, we're going to do this. She's a bad bitch. I'm not doing all three. I'm doing all three. We're going to cheers it right now. The gates of hell and the coven. 
The we're boss ass bitches because we did it. We were the only two that went into the, only two, and we the finished. Gatel, and we finished. We didn't even say purgatory. We did it. Okay, listen. <laughs> Act- that, we fell through, through the exit door. <laughs> to where the actors were like, fuck. Okay, get they up. They were like, girls. He was like, girls. get up. Get yeah, up. yeah. <laughs> It was so good, but they good. verbally abuse you. They cuss at you and talk to you Crazy. nasty. Yeah. They talk to you. They zap the fuck out they of you. They on YouTube. They called us the, the C, C word. word. Okay. And yeah. it was so good. Now, we had a girl at work tell us not to go. Because it was so scary. Because it was so bad and this and that. Dude, it was so good. That was good. the funnest haunted house that I think I've so ever That was so fucking to. cool. And honestly, for the scariest in the U.S., that really that wasn't, wasn't that bad. That wasn't that scary. That wasn't that bad. It Just really wasn't. Just the zapping is what, like, that was painful. But everything <laughs> else, I like that they called me the C word and was, like, verbally abusing I was into it. Yeah, was it into was cool. It, it was cool. Because, like, it they was talk cool. to you, like... Oh, dude, it's good. You it's guys, good. You, if you haven't gone, you have fucking to go. go. Um, I, we don't want to give away too many surprises, but good. Anyone who tells you don't do it. Yeah, don't let anyone discourage you. Because it you was can get not through that them. bad. It was not that bad. It, it was not. And we went through Coven. Coven was super cool. Yeah. That really wasn't that scary. I mean, it was scary. It was more confined spaces that freaked yes. me out. That if I you're like. claustrophobic... Coven will fuck with you for sure. Yeah, at one point we felt like we were being birthed into the world. Yeah, like we were the coming walls out of the womb. Oh yeah, it's yeah. It's like crazy. It was good. It was super good. So highly recommend. So fun. Um, I wish I could have brought my phone in. I guess you can't. I should have brought it in with me, but and you just can't. put it in your pocket. Yeah, like... because you can bring your phone into the area, but you can't like have it on. You should show them the final picture too. Oh my god, yes. We'll put the pictures up. They take pictures of you. They're so good. They're fucking <laughs> No, yeah, you guys should check it out. Gates of Hell Freakling Brothers. Um, 40 bucks for all three haunted houses or 15 for the two easier ones and then it's 17 for the mm-hmm. rated R one. Yeah. You do have to sign a couple waivers. Best money well spent. Yeah, it was good. Tis the season. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna do an overall review on what I thought of the haunted houses. I did not go into the rated like PG ones, so there's three of them. There's one that's like kids could totally go into. They have the medium one, like I said in the videos, that one's um, like PG 13, and then they have a rated R. So I went to the PG 13 and the rated R. Um, what did I think of them? I fucking loved them. They were so good, so worth the money. I was told by so many people. Oh my god, they're so scary. They're terrible. They're awful. They spit on you. They push you. They they grab you. Ugh. And then I saw in the news too <laughs> that some girls were like, oh, oh, they grabbed my boobs. They grabbed my boobs. They <laughs> Oh my god, shut the fuck up. You damn well know if you gotta sign a waiver, you know that shit is gonna be inappropriate as fuck. Now, people were saying, like I said, that they got spit on. You do not get fucking spit on. You do you do get wet and they do pretend to like do certain things. I don't want to give anything away, but um, it's not fucking spit or throw up or whatever the fuck you really think it is. It's not. Um, it's like this weird gel stuff. It, it feels like gel. Like when I came out of my hair, I felt the back of my head. It felt like my hair was like crusted from gel, which is still pretty gross, but not as gross as like spit or vomit. Um, um, now when they grab you, they do touch you, they do grab you. You actually see the actors before they even approach you. It's like they're running towards you and then they kind of like touch you a little bit, but nothing super aggressive. When they push you, it's literally like a little tiny, tiny tap push. Like they're not, like people are so exaggerated with how they describe the haunted houses. And after I experienced it, I was like, these girls are a bunch of bitches, like for real. Like it's not bad at all. I thought it was great, and like I said, you're signing a fucking waiver, so of course you're gonna get verbally abused and touched, like, you fucking signed up for it. And they also, um, like, the girls on the news that were like, they sexually abused me and grabbed my titty and... Okay, it's dark as fuck in there, and it is their job to harass you. Yeah, they're... They probably... You did scare the fuck out of me, this little bitch. But yeah... They accidentally touch your titty. Dude, it's dark as fuck in there. They're not trying to grab your titty, but like I said, you sign the waiver. They're not intentionally trying to grab your boobs and butt and whatever, but if they do, it's dark as fuck. It's smoky as fuck. And yeah, people need to get over it. If 
you don't want your your butt or boobs being touched by accident, don't fucking go. If you don't like being cussed at and being called a cunt, don't go. If you don't like weird, gooey hand sanitizer like shit or gel in your hair, you don't want to get wet, don't fucking go. <laughs> but if you're not a little bitch and you're boss ass bitch, go ahead and go because it was fucking awesome. I loved it. I, actually, to be honest, how they say it's the scariest haunted house in America, I actually was kind of surprised because I, I'll have to say I thought it would be scarier. I mean, maybe it's just because I'm into fucked up shit that it didn't scare me as bad. I don't really know, but it was still really awesome. But yeah, so I do highly recommend um, if they are in your town or city nearby, go check them out. Super fun. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and shut this video down now talking forever um so yeah i will see you guys next week and uh maybe with some more spooky shit yeah never know tis the season bye <laughs>